We see renewables as the future for energy, and we see it as the next step for us as a business. Subsea cables are the umbilical, really, between the offshore wind and the consumer on the land. And without that infrastructure, the wind farm is useless, essentially. The partnership with IBM is all about trying to aggregate some of the data we have across industries and make sense out of it. When we work with our clients, we use storytelling to really build that future vision and the future roadmap of what they can do with their data, and we outline steps that they need to take to get to that big picture. An analogy would be just exploring the desert without a compass. When you build data science solution or optimization solution, everything is driven by the data. We've used Watson Studio to develop toolkits for offshore wind to better understand how to maintain cables in a predictive way. Data visualization will play more and more an important and essential role in every data science project because of its power to communicate and explain the stories behind data science. When I walked into the room and saw the dashboard for the first time, I could see it really, really clearly that this could be a very powerful tool for us as we move forward in trying to improve efficiency. I thought, yes, eventually, we've got something that gives me an indication of the condition of those cables. Using CloudPack for data, where trust and security is really built into the platform, governance is built in, a company like James Fisher could at all times track how their data is used, where it's coming from, who's using it, and they can also track the use of models, the people who are using data, and in a company like James Fisher, which has massive amount of data, as well as data from their partners, that's incredibly important. It's unleashed a, a desire from me to see how we can use AI on other parts of the business that we hadn't even really thought of up to now. We don't know where this could go, actually. But we're on a journey and we're really excited about it. And hopefully uh, we, get, we get a better environment and we get a long-term future for this world.